Alright, what's going on everyone? It's your boy Caleb here. Been uh, busy as heck lately. Literally just got back from the Bassmaster Classic and finally have time to chop this video up for you guys. So this is from a couple weekends ago on Otisco Lake with my great buddy Brian. Uh, we went out and did pretty well. Found a little uh, post-spawn bite. There was like packs of them cruising. So uh, yeah, you'll see that in the video. But had a great time at the Bassmaster uh, Classic. Came back with a little toy. So subscribe and stay tuned to see the unveiling of said toy. Met a ton of people. Um, did a little bit of partying. And overall just had a great time. So uh, without further ado, we'll get right into this video. It's a big one, whatever it is. Oh, it's a big musky. <laughs> yeah. You wanna get the net out? It's kinda like all but It's a big ass musky. He nailed it on the way down. That's kinda sick. <laughs> I mean, it's not giant, but. It's fun. And he goes. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Pretty badass. <laughs> pretty sick. I might get a picture of that. That was pretty cool. I figured it'd be a musky. You kind of, you kind of hit it like a musky. Yeah, these look like uh, empty. Looks like old smallmouth beds to me. There definitely was one spawn in there. A few weeks, usually like three weeks or so, usually. Are there ever tournaments when they're on the back and you still fish them? Oh yeah. I've weighed, I've weighed bed fish before, for sure. Definitely not something that you want to do, but when there's money on the line, if there's fatties on beds, you go catch them. Yeah, the weeds aren't really grown up yet here. Oh, I got one. Oh, I got a big one, dude. Oh, nice. There's one with it too. Look at it. Look at the one with it. There's one the same size right next to it. Dude, let's go. Look at them. That's, there's three of them. That's so sick. Look, they're chasing each other. There's three of them, dude. That was sick. <laughs> That was awesome. Look at them, they're still there. Drop to them, see if one will bite. Right right below the boat, right here. They're like schooled up, post spawn. That was sick, definitely post spawn. Squatted up. That was awesome. <laughs> Take that. Skinny, skinny long guy. Post spawn, John. Shut up. That was cool. <laughs> See all three. The other two look bigger, honestly. I think I got the little one to bite. Those are definitely post spawn fish. What'd you say? You see him? That was cool. Well, there was, those are a pot of post spawners. So what they do is I like kind of school up like that sometimes and just cruise around. Probably dropped it close to their face. That's what I'm saying. You probably just put it right in there. Little... There's probably a lot of pods of those, though. Usually, there's not just one pod. Usually, there's like a bunch cruising around. I don't really know why he was here, though. It's like not like there's that good of weeds or nothing. Kind of a random spot for him to be chilling. Yeah, see, that's a pretty big one, dude. Oh, I got one. I got one. Oh, they're stacked, bro. They're stacked here. This is a big one, too. They're stacked on this drop off, post spawn. We just gotta make long casts, cause if they can see us, they're not gonna bite. Dude, this is bigger than the last. This is like a four pounder, bro. Let's go, I got the vid going. Let's go. Nice. This is sick, bro. We're on them. We're on them. We're on them, my guy. <laughs> oh, that's a good fish, my guy. Might be a picture of the one. Look at that. That's cool. That's a four-younder. That'd be a 
a weighable one in the tourney. Nice four yonder. Ah, that's sick. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, we're gonna work this whole thing. We're just gonna jerk this edge. So pretty much like right where the boat is, like just keep casting onto that edge. They're hitting it instantly, bro. As soon as he gets in their face, they're biting. Like they want a munch, which I didn't expect. I might try a jig too, but I mean, they're fighting this, so might as well keep throwing it. There's a lot of bluegill and stuff around. I think the bass are just cruising around much on bluegill. Getting tapped like every cast. Give me a second. I might, I might need it though. No worries. This feels like a big one though. <laughs> Watch it be tiny. It might be a musky. Oh no, it's a nice largey. Not as big as the last. Decent one though. Casual, I'm like. <laughs> hey. Post spawn. You got your video rolling? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is this is definitely turn getting get turned into a video. <laughs> Catch them on a uh, little drop shot robo worm. But they're munching. The, the key is you can't get too close to them. If you make a long cast and uh, they, they don't see you, they'll bite it pretty much every time. But if you're right on top of them, they're not biting. So key is long cast and a little drop shot. Got one. <laughs> this is stupid, bro. This is just stupid. Little guy. Oh, I jumped off. Little guy. He was in the weed bed out here around the edge. Let's go. Keep your rod tip down, keep your rod tip down. Dude, they're stacked. Let's go. Exactly how you said to do it. Too. Yeah. I literally just <laughs> all right, right. I got it. You got I the got technique it. down now. Here, I'll grab him for you. Not, not he says it's a monster. It's a monster. <laughs> it's a monster. Like a monster. <laughs> like monster. Nah, it happens. It happens. That's a nice one, dude. Is that smallmouth? That's a smallmouth, bro. Just tiring them out for a second. Yeah, whenever you want them, just bring them my way. I'll grab them. Right, one more. <laughs> you ain't giving up yet. <laughs> the smallies got a lot of fight in them. Ooh, that's a nice smallie, bro. <laughs> nice. You got your groove now, bro. Hey, did you hear about the one arm fisherman? No. It <laughs> <laughs> took me a second. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm about to show you something gross for the video. This guy caught a prop. Jesus a Christ. That's a gash. Wow. That's crazy. Seems to be doing all right. Look pretty healthy. Looks fine. Other than that. Go. Got one? Set hard, you guys set harder. Let's go, you're crushing it today, bro. Oh, that's a tank. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one, dude. Keep that shit tight. That's a big one, bro. Bring them over my way, I'll, I'll grab them. That's a big one, dude. Nice. Good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> First cast First on the cast. jig, right? Yep. Good stuff, dude. I'm gonna grab the pit camera for that. Got you. Got gotcha. you. Do you hit it good? Oh, reasonably. Felt a pretty good hit. Felt like you some weight on it, and then I like, hmm, kind of could be a weed or a fish, and then the movement, and then I just bolt. You got, yeah, you could set. You should set way harder next time. Like, you got a hook in them, but see how I just set? That's how you want to set. Hard. Too? Little one. You want to set hard like that, though. Ooh, my bad. My bad, bro. Give you a little brain damage. He was out in the weed bed out here. He was out there. Got one? Big one? Oh my god, bro. That's a giant. That's a giant, bro. Smallie. Oh, it broke the line. 
That's an absolute giant. He came off. That was an absolute giant, my guy. That was a five pounder. That's him, right? 100%. He's to the left. He's to the left of the rope. Yeah, yeah that's him. For sure, that's him. I don't know who he's gonna munch, but he wants one of her. So he's a big ass smallie. You have him on? You got him, bro. You got him. Get that f***er, you got him, my guy. Keep it home. Take him easy. That's a giant small mouth, my guy. Take him easy. I'll get him for you. That's a giant, bro. Nah, I got you, I got you. Oh, shit. I knew that was gonna happen. That's all <laughs> Now we got a little predicament. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. <laughs> ah, I got you. Good shit. Quick picture, quick picture. Get your phone out. You got your phone? Yeah. Let's go quick, because he's on a bed. I want to get him back. Let's go quick as we can. One. All right, you can toss it. Should go right back. All right, so as you can see, this was a really fun day with Brian. I didn't even put in all our fish catches because, again, I feel like it gets repetitive. And, uh, I mean, it's just a lot of the same stuff over and over. So we caught a ton of fish. Um, most post-spawn, Brian did catch the one smallmouth off the bed at the end. But I would say a majority of those fish were already off beds out there. And it was kind of funny because we went to Onondaga the day before. And it was like the complete opposite. It was like peak spawn out there. So it's funny how different lakes will fish differently even in the same area at the same time and uh we yeah we didn't do very well in onondaga so it's it was nice to go to otisco then and you know jack them so got a lot of dope content on the way uh the grind series more fishing videos more term videos coming bass season opens up in new york saturday i'm helping run the uh douglas big money open and then sunday i'm fishing a tournament on otisco so Plenty of stuff coming. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, like this video, comment, and we will see you next time.